Okay, go ahead. Mister. So, before I head off to the track, I gotta stop by the hardware store. Uh, the battery bracket, battery strap on my buggy. Right now I just have some computer screws holding the uh, strap down and the heads are all stripped out on them. I've been meaning to get some threaded rod and some nuts to make a more streamlined system for a while, but I just haven't gotten around to it. So, since the hardware store just opened, we're gonna swing by there quick and pick up uh, those supplies. Got what I needed, some brass thumb screws and some all thread. I'm gonna cut that down to size and then make a quick change uh, thumb knob release for my battery strap. Now off to uh, breakfast and then off to the track, get all set up and ready to go. So there are 13 heat today, I'm in heat 10, Keith is in heat, I think, 6 and 11? No, 2 and 11. 1 and 11? I'd have to ask him, I don't remember. I know he's one after me, so I'll be marshalling for him. I'm up now. First race of the day for me. Been racing for about two hours so far, and we're finally on heat 10. At least I get in middle position here, so it's a little easier. <laughs> Do a flip! Yep, I was exactly right. The uh, head sheared right off those screws. There should be four, um, but one was missing and then uh, another one got stripped out really bad. So I was just running with the two top ones and must have hit uh, on the back of the tires and just sheared it right off. It's kind of cool. The uh, shock tower looks like it's still in pretty good condition though. I'm gonna get these studs removed uh, here real quick. I'm not sure how I'm gonna remove the shorter one because one's too long. All right, we'll see what I can do here. I see that. Thank you. I'll eat it in a bit. I want to get my car fixed. I still play second. Yeah, I still think I, it was either second or third. It was far from last. Of course it helped that it was up against mostly kids. Okay, JR. I got a challenge for you. Huh? I got a challenge for you. How do I get that out? Get what out? Get that out. You don't. Just leave it? Leave it, put the other three in there and call it good. All right. I guess I'm running with three screws in my shock tower. This is it, my final. 
Thanks, I'll need it. Yep, yeah, that was me. Perfect. Thank you. Everyone has checked in. Uh, we'll go ahead and finish it up. So you can go ahead and we'll stage you up on the back straightaway. All right. Here we go. Paul flying in the number one position. Brandon Bashay. Paul flying in the number two position. Zach Watson. Paul flying number three. Kevin McCall. Paul flying number four. Max. Four. Ball number five, Jules Four. Ball flying number six, Scott Bittner. Ball flying number seven, Eva Mickelson. And ball flying in the number eight position is Reese Four. Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be a heads up start. When you hear the tone, the race is on. But as always, we want a nice, clean start. Watch those first few corners. The race director may decide to do a restart. We will let you know. Race is ready at the sound of the tone. Heads up in the middle of the track. Three vehicles down in the middle of the track. There's one behind the top. They're just trucks. I can do it, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. We are showing the following order. Brandon, Kevin, Zach, Reese, Jules, Eva, Scott, and Max. Alright, thanks job, Marcus. We're keeping them going here. You're always tuning in on the internet. You're watching Saturday Racing Action at Thunder Road RC Raceway in Wake Park, Minnesota. Okay, I'm still showing Brandon right on front here, followed by Kevin, Zach, Ava, Reese, Jules, Max, and Scott. Oh, God, what am I doing? Oh. No! Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God! 15 seconds left, drivers. 15 seconds left. Remember when you hear the tone, continue racing. The race is still on. Caution to the left of the driver's stand. Time has expired. The order is Kevin Brennan, Zach, Ava, Reese, Jules, Max, and Scott. Keep racing until your name is called. Max, you're done. Scott, you're done. Brandon, you're done. Zach, you're done. Ava, you're done. Oh, you're done. Reese and Jules, still going. Jules, you're done. Reese, you're done. All in, all done. You're finishing order for that race. Kevin, Brandon, Zach, Ava, Reese, Jules. Yes! Holy crap! You got in your head, though. Man, you should have answered Nathan George. <gasps> Cameron Cole. Yeah. Oh my god. You got, like I say, you got into your head just a little bit. You got a little nervous, but you. Oh boy. Trophies is good. Trophies is good. <laughs> oh my god. I gotta get out there and marshal now. Yeah. Oh, I'm stoked. Alright, thanks so much. It turned off. It turned off. No, the screen did. It's still rolling. Are you sure? It turned off. Zach, you're up. I have no idea if I've got everybody in the picture or not because it doesn't. <laughs> Yay, Zach got a trophy, third place. Woohoo! It's even got a granite base. Wow. Is that because we live in that granite city? Is that granite or marble? It looks like marble. I don't know. Maybe it's marble. Third place, Sparseman. Not bad for having only raised once in the past year, I would like to say. Finishing up the night with delicious lasagna rolls and fresh focaccia bread. I'm extremely happy with how today ended up. It got off to a little bit of a rocky start. I wasn't sure if I'd be able to participate because they wouldn't accept that little coupon that I had. But it ended up working out in the end. 
And I'm hoping that this is just the first of many more trophies to come. Probably get a comedic can next weekend. I don't know if I'm going to uh, get any content for that because I got content for this. And it's the same thing over and over. But uh, that's going to do it for me today, guys. If you like the video, make sure to like it. Subscribe for more content like this. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.